All right, well, we have got a, a pretty breezy start to the day across Minnesota and western Wisconsin. Weather watchers helping us keep track of things after a pretty nice weekend. Let's see what they're saying this morning. Uh, 40s and 50s looks like for the most part we've got 42 degrees as we look over to western Wisconsin. Mike and Dee in Shell Lake saying crisp, cool, and warmer than yesterday morning. Bright moon out. Nice to see that. Let's give you another look maybe a little bit further out west. 50 degrees down in southwestern Minnesota. This is Sandy in Wyndham. Nice temperatures this morning. What a fabulous weather weekend. Sure, we had the top 10 weather day on Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Actually, about 10 degrees cooler uh, than Friday, but still some nice days there. 48 degrees right now from looks like Arnie in Ward Springs. A clear morning is offering another excellent view of the morning star in the eastern sky. It's actually Venus. All right, if you got a telescope and you know where to look, Arnie's setting you up there. 35 from Jeff and Pam and Haugen, so chilly there off to the northeast. Looking like a nice Monday. Will be a nice day today. More sunshine. Temperatures are going to be right about average and these winds will be persistent. Let's call them that. Right now they're in out of the southeast 10 to 20 miles an hour for the most part across Minnesota or right in the middle here in the Twin Cities at 15 mile an hour winds and we do have some gusts stronger than that out west. 26 miles an hour just updating there for Wilmer. 31 mile an hour gust for Redwood Falls. 26 miles an hour in Alexandria. 21 mile an hour gust up towards Bemidji. So breezy in spots especially out west this morning. Otherwise, we've got clear skies over the Twin Cities, clouds patching north and west, and rain we're keeping an eye on down to the south. Now, most of this is moving pretty much straight west to east. However, kind of that northern edge of it, that's got a little bit of a northeasterly component that could track into south central or southeastern Minnesota later on this morning. So we'll be watching this closely as it makes its way primarily through Iowa, but could clip southern Minnesota as well. Well, here in the Twin Cities, that will not bother us. Sunshine to start, actually a pretty nice morning. We'll go from 47 uh, to start to 62 by noon, and then we'll keep on climbing, climbing from there, right around 67 for a high today. I still think we're dry by about 5 o'clock, but later on this evening, we do have a chance for some isolated thunderstorms to develop. Uh, it's not going to be widespread, and there's a chance the Twin Cities can make it through completely dry this evening, but we'll just mention that chance for storms through the evening hours. After about midnight or so, should just be clouds and 51 are overnight low, leading to a pretty quiet day tomorrow. Mostly cloudy here in the Twin Cities, but 70 degrees for a high. Gray skies over western Wisconsin, so cooler there. Low 60s and quite a bit of sunshine off to the north and west. Real nice day up in Bemidji, 66 for your high there tomorrow. Uh, rest of the week looks pretty quiet. Upper 60s, low 70s, quite a bit of sunshine, especially towards the end of the week. Uh, Thursday, Friday look to be the nicer days on the forecast. Uh, moving towards the weekend, right now I'd say there's a, a chance for some rain, but it's so far off it's not worth worrying about just yet. A lot can change between now and Saturday and Sunday. Uh, otherwise, that is about as average of yeah. a week as you can get in uh, in mid-May. So there you go, upper 60s, low 70s. Looks good. Looks awesome. Very